Hello and welcome to Kismet Rising. So during the course of this video I've mentioned on more than one occasion that we are leading up to the Pisces new moon but that is in fact an error. In fact what we are leading up to is the Pisces full moon so forgive my uh, mistakes and I hope you enjoy the video. Hello and welcome to Kismet Rising. I'd like to say thank you to all the subscribers and uh, to those of you who come and like the video and comment. I really appreciate your feedback and thank you for all your support. So I'm coming to you this week because I just want to talk a little bit about the energy which I hadn't mentioned in the last energy forecast which I put out. So last week I put out an, a video in which we talked about the energy from September this year in 2019 till the end of the year and I looked at the broad energy and I looked at it in contrast to the energy that we experienced in the last and the 10 months before that prior to that as well as taking into account some of the eclipses and how that would have impacted us. So I'm not an astrologer but I do actually uh, pick up the energy sometimes also with information about um, astrology and so so basically what, what I want to tell you today uh, is that we're coming up to a Pisces new moon uh, at the end of the week and a lot of you might be feeling this in many different ways and so if you're one of these people who are struggling this week and you know the last few days have been really difficult towards the end of last week you've been crying a lot you've been struggling with your health you've been having um, physical difficulties you've been you know meeting and to accidents or having just crying and not really understanding why you why you're crying i just want to say that this kind of energy is leading up to the end of this week and what you're going to find is that uh, it's a kind of a lot of emotional energy and it's almost as if like there's something shifting underneath you you don't have your grounding you don't have your 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 sense of knowing that you're okay you're almost questioning things um you might be having some kind of existential crisis or it might just be that you, you just can't come to terms with your health you're in a lot of pain uh, for those of you who are having difficulties with with your health um for some of you you might be questioning you know uh, your your path you know have you chosen the right path have you chosen the right career are you in the right job you might also be uh questioning yourself um you know you might be at a low having low confidence levels and so you'll be questioning yourself and not actually uh, be sure about why you're doing what you're doing and i want to say that what you're experiencing right now like very often when you actually have these feelings you should consider them but right now it's it's largely due to the energy that we have at this at this moment so don't question yourselves too deeply you know don't make huge life changes or decisions at this point to impact uh, yourself in the future wait until this energy is passed wait until um after you know the mid mid next week so like if, if the Pisces new moon which is on Saturday like wait until like Wednesday next week or even a little bit later and you're gonna find that you slowly come back into yourself and you you start to have more confidence in yourself and you won't be questioning that much you'll have a lot more faith in the direction that you've taken and in the decisions that you've taken before so if you are one of those people that are having difficulties just bide your time you know it will soon be over and in the meantime just try to take the best care that you can of yourself so that this energy is not getting the better of you so i just want to add that uh, to your week and hopefully this message helps you for those of you who are struggling for those of you who are having a wonderful time and uh, uh you don't you're not really impacted with by this energy you probably have a lot more uh earth Earth energy. If you're a water sign, you're more prone to this kind of thing. Or if you have water in your moon or water in your in your birth chart, you'll be more prone to uh, being impacted by this energy this week because it's as I mentioned, it's a very unstable energy. And what we're looking for is kind of grounding. So just to recap, the energy this week it might be a bit turbulent, it might be a bit difficult, it might be a bit emotional. You may be questioning yourself and uh, it might be you might be feeling like confidence has been eroded you just don't believe in yourself anymore or you don't believe in the path that you've taken or you just don't have faith that you're going to heal from some kind of ailment that you have or uh, some kind of health issue that you have. So d don't worry it's it, just wait you don't make any decisions right now wait until the energy has passed and um, uh, you know at the midweek next week uh, like let's say by Wednesday the following week uh, things are going to work out much better you'll be doing much better so I think about the the 17th 18th 19th 20th by the 20th you should be quite clear from this energy um, and you might also have been feeling this for about a 
about a week and a half before this so you you might have been feeling this um at the just after the new moon had ended uh, for some of you it would be like that because you're more sensitive and you can feel the energy coming to you uh as opposed to when the energy is there by the time the energy is there as it's built up to this uh full moon it's almost like you're in strength and you can actually let go of that energy okay so uh it's no longer impacting you you've come full circle and it, you're able to release it so i don't see this being a permanent thing i see it just being a temporary thing and it will but boil over so i'm wishing you a fabulous rest of the week and i hope that you're all doing well wonderfully uh cons considering what the energies are and uh yeah blessings abound from kismet rising take good care